Yo, I... Why did you try and grab it by the butthole? What the fuck was Remember that? Remember to eat your vegetables. Maybe don't do that. Can I grab this? I can. Welcome to the show. It's here. And it's me. Hello. Welcome. Hi. <laughs> Welcome to the Possible Gamer Channel, where everybody's a possible and welcome to the show. Hi. <laughs> oh my god, I'm getting called a bitch. Muffin at you, just be subscribed for 22 months. Do do do. <laughs> oh, let's refocus that camera. There we go. Beautiful. Well, welcome to the goddamn thing where we're doing this stuff. Hello, everyone. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Muffin, thank you so much for that resubscribe. Calling me a bitch as a term of endearment. I appreciate that. We can't buy the one chip challenge anymore. You can't? Is it illegal? Did they make it a crime? Anyway, welcome to the show. <laughs> we're here. We are live in front of my live studio audience on Twitch. I still have auto tune on. Hold on. There we go. Now I sound like a regular person again. Welcome, everybody. It's me, the possum, on the possum show on the possum channel. Some kid died after eating one. Holy shit. That's real intense. I didn't real. I didn't know that. They must have. Uh... That must be new because I remember. I think I did the 2022 challenge. I think that was maybe the 2021 challenge. Yeah, no, that was the 2021 ship. And then the 2022 one died your tongue blue. And then there was a 2023 one. But yeah, that must have been the one that got pulled. That's crazy. That's crazy. I, that, I'm fine with it because <laughs> I wasn't going to do it anytime soon. Those chips were fucking that was a fucking nightmare, both in my mouth for like the hour that it was there and in my butthole for like a week after. Like it, it felt like a burning ember in the pit of my stomach. It fucking sucked. So I wasn't going to redo that anytime soon anyway. Rest in peace to that kid, though. I fucking guess. Uh, <laughs> welcome to the stream, everyone. We've got a few early birds. Holy shit. We got Tangy Pop. Bam. And we got Muffin. Right there. Boom. Here you go. Enjoy. You can do the... Oh, oh, we can do the magic trick. Hold on. Hold on. Bah, boom. Are you guys impressed? I'm fucking impressed. I... I'm incredible. And so humble. <laughs> what is regular? I wouldn't know it. Uh, especially with my bowel movements, they're very not regular, but they're better than they were yesterday. We're doing fine. Uh, but welcome to the stream, everyone. I'm sorry it started off so weird. It just happens like this. Uh, today, the plan, we can already, we can, st oh my god, don't show your pits. Don't show pits on stream. That's, that's special time stuff. Don't look at that. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> Uh, but today's stream is going to be pretty fun. Uh, I have some content. Coco, Why can you buy more than one worm? Say, okay. I mean, don't. It's just a baby. But you could, I guess, I if you want. Say, okay, Mom. I just baby. <laughs> Goes against the spirit of the worm, I think. I don't know. Is there a way to limit it? Maybe there's, Maybe I should figure that out. I should be a professional Twitch streamer. You know, I'm so good at it already. I should just do this full time. <laughs> oh, God. But you are just a baby muffin. Let's see. I thought I thought I made it so that only one person could redeem, but maybe it. Yeah, limit redemptions per user per stream. It's just one. Yeah, you can't get another one. You can set it to one person per stream, and I have. So, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> maybe you claim to worm and some other. I don't know. I don't know. There's weird glitches and stuff here and there, but yeah, I have the settings set right. So it's it's not it's not on me. It's not my fault. Mine said it's worth one. I mean, you can try it. It'll, it'll probably block it out, though. I don't know. Or maybe it'll just ban your account. That could be fun. I don't know what the punishment is for taking extra worms. Do you really want to find out? Uh, what was I talking about? <laughs> I was talking about what we're going to be doing today. Because uh, the title doesn't really explain a whole lot. It just says, what, retro horror dumpster dive or whatever. Oh, uh, mobile just doesn't alert you to it until you try. Gotcha. Mobile, the mobile stuff has been kind of glitching out lately. It's probably because they just rolled out the fucking, um, it's probably because they just rolled out the stories update on mobile and stuff too. So like some stuff probably got fucked up because Jazz was having troubles yesterday redeeming the jump scare and stuff. Anyway, worm capitalism, probably throw a parade to celebrate Hawking of the Worms. Uh, not here. Not here. Not in my Christian Minecraft server. 
Ah, uh, but yes, today, to be a little more descriptive of what we're doing, you don't see Twitch stories anywhere. I see them on the mobile app. You'd have to make sure it's uh, fully updated and also that people you follow are posting on it. I think it's probably the main thing. I don't know if a lot of creators know about them. I haven't used them yet, so I'm not real sure how that process works. I should, though. Um, but today we're playing some retro games. Opinion on Kick. I fucking hate Kick. Like the streaming platform? It sucks. Fuck that place. It's full of Nazis and losers. I hate it. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, today we're playing some... Old school retro horror games, and by retro and old school, I mean like NES, Genesis, uh, 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 fucking, fucking Super Nintendo. There we go. Uh, we're trying not to get newer than that. I'm, I don't think I'm gonna dive into like PS1 stuff today. I'm, I kind of wanted to see where the genre was at before things like Resident Evil and Silent Hill kind of hit the scene. Uh, so yeah, that that's. That, that's what we're doing. Retro horror like Splatterhouse. Exactly, Tangy Pop. One of the first games I want to play today is Splatterhouse 2 and 3. Because I don't have access to Splatterhouse 1. Was that only was that an arcade only thing? I couldn't find much information on it. I didn't see a home release. But yeah, we're definitely checking out Splatterhouse. Splatterhouse 2 and 3. Uh, I, I have some fond memories of those because I actually played the PS3 Splatterhouse a lot. Uh, and that game's really, really fun. I should play that on here sometime. Uh, come to think of it, I think that actually has ports of the original Splatterhouses in it. It's also a super rare fucking game. Anyway. Uh, literally can't even go on there anymore because the mobile version's ass. When will they release a phone that actually lasts 24 hours? I don't know. Who needs that? Just charge your dang phone. <laughs> Devil's Crush on TG16 is horror-themed, you guys. I don't know. Is that... Turbo Graphics 16? I'm smart. I know what I'm talking about. I don't have that though. I don't have um I don't have anything older than NES or anything like I don't know when did Turbo Graphics 16 come out? Is that old? I don't know. But we got like Genesis, NES and Super Nintendo stuff to look at today. That's what we're doing. We're not doing any like old Windows stuff and we're not doing uh, anything past that, you know what I mean? So it's going to be fun. I have a shit ton of games and most of them are probably going to suck. So we can start whenever. But yeah, I, I'm really excited because I found a lot of interesting stuff that I want to try today. And I also had to do a lot of tinkering to make sure that my emulators were working properly and stuff because <laughs> they've been they've been glitching out on me for a bit. Uh, but I think I got it all figured out and I think we're good. You lost 29 percent in less than three hours. Um... That sounds terrible. You should get a different phone muffin. <laughs> Port Turbo Graphics, it's pinball. There's a Genesis port. It's not called Devil's Crush. It's called Devil's Nuts. Uh, but I've got, I mean, I don't, can I show you guys what I have? I think I can. Do I have this set up right? What console did the original Paper Mario release? The Nintendo 64. Uh, Devil's Crush these nuts. That's what I'm saying, dude. Uh, we can take a look. <laughs> We can take a look at some of the shit I have here. I'm definitely going to be... My face cam's going to be in the way. I can move that if we need to. You know. Uh, maybe. Not right now, I guess. <laughs> my, my my stream deck buttons aren't working, so I guess I can't move myself. That's fine. Uh, but yeah, we've got fucking... I want to try Bram Stoker's Dracula for Genesis. Uh, which I think you guys can see. Yeah. Fucking Shakan, which I actually really like this game. Uh, if, if it's the one I remember. This one's actually really, really cool. Uh, Dark Castle, I've heard, is awful. Decap Attack looks awful. The Immortal looks awful. Uh, and yeah, Splatterhouse 2 and 3. Like, th those ones are going to be good. So I know these ones are going to be fun. Uh, you have a Note 20 5G. What do I have? I think I have, like, an S21 Ultra or something. I don't know. My phone's a few years behind now, too, by this point, too. So I don't even know. Uh, what emulator app is it? This is LaunchBox. Which it takes some setting up. You'll probably also have to set it up through like RetroArch and stuff like that. But it's the best place I've found to kind of congregate all of my shit. And it lets me use a better PS2 emulator than the one that comes with RetroArch. So I like LaunchBox quite a bit, actually. Uh, plus, it, it gives you all these cool things. Like, this is a cool way to look at the collection, honestly. You can't even lie. <laughs> you're pestering me to play Paper Mario. I know. I should play Paper Mario. 
and I should play Thousand Year Door. I just, I'm never in the mood to start a long RPG like that. <laughs> uh, my favorite is the Wii version, even though people hate it. I think, so, so that's Super Paper Mario, and like the consensus on that has flipped, right? Because a lot of people hated it when it came out because it was kind of nothing like Thousand Year Door. But what it is is also really good and cool and fun. So like that people have kind of flipped their opinions on it. So, yeah, I think I think I think the general consensus is it's good, but it doesn't feel like a Paper Mario game. So uh, you have an A15 because you're overspending a thousand dollars on a flagship phone to stay the latest and greatest. You're not. Yeah, you're over spending a thousand dollars. I got you. I know how to read. Uh <laughs> I, I just like having a nice phone, and this one's lasted me a long time. I'm glad the like planned obsolescence uh, felt uh, the, the the planned obsolescence of this phone feels very limited, which is cool. So I'm happy with it. Uh, Muffin, no, this is not on Steam. This is a standalone thing I had to download. Uh, and there's a free version and a paid version, and I don't even know what the paid version does for you. But the free version is like fully featured. It's dope. Uh, sorry, you're late. Iggy, no, you're all good, dude. You're all good. <laughs> uh, but yeah, Super Paper Mario, I don't I don't even remember if there was RPG combat in it. I, I haven't played it. So not from what I've seen anyway. Uh, I mean, while we're here, we may as well freaking get going into something. Uh, I want to start on Genesis. I don't know why. And I guess <laughs> Dark Castle. I mean, you said it. <sighs> it's horror themed. Altered Beast, True Horror. I guess we could try Altered Beast. Altered Beast is not good. <laughs> I don't think. I think Altered Beast is okay. Uh, I think it was definitely cool for a launch title, but I don't think it's a great game. Uh, I guess we can also go over some of the other stuff I have. I have a shit ton of NES games here. Uh, standouts include Kid Dracula. I, I actually really like that one. Uh, from what I've played, the limited amounts that I've played of it. This one's really cute. Friday the 13th, because you got to play that, right? It's it's a classic, I guess. <laughs> it exists, doesn't it? I don't know why it's I don't know why I have a Japanese version of Maniac Mansion. That's wrong. We probably won't play that one today. <laughs> uh, we got Monster Party and Nightmare on Elm Street, though. Those are all also games that exist. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, yeah, yeah. There's the cute little chibi Splatterhouse. Splatterhouse Wompaku Graffiti. Uh, I don't know why this exists, but it's adorable looking. Uh, we got Sweet Home. This is a translated version of Sweet Home. So if we do play it, it'll actually make sense to us because I do not speak Japanese. Uh, <laughs> Ghouls and Ghosts, maybe. Uh, I don't know. if Do I have Ghouls and Ghosts somewhere? I'm trying to find like some of the weirder ones because, I, like I said, I want to get a feel for what the horror genre looked like before the advent of games like, you know, Silent Hill and Resident Evil and stuff like that. I want to kind of get a feel for what stuff was like before that, because from what I've seen, it's very weird and very all over the place. Uh, what store do I get my ROMs from? Uh, I don't know if I can talk about that openly. <laughs> uh, what the fuck is it even called? Layer? Vim's Layer? Look, Google that. That ought to help. Uh, and that's where I get most of the stuff, which, mind you, I do have all of these games physically. <laughs> uh, so, you know, not not illegal. I own these anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you go. That's 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 what it is. Just don't report me to the Twitch police. They'll probably get sad at me. All right. We're going to start with Dark Castle because Tangy Pop says it's the worst game on all systems. So let's fucking go. I totally have backups for all my games. I mean, honestly, like, all jokes aside, I do own, I'd say, a good 90% of the games on this. Okay, let me know if the capture's weird or anything like that. What did I say? Twisted Metal is horror-related? Maybe. It's fun. I'm not good at it, but it's fun. Okay, Dark Castle. Game paused. I didn't start the game. Oh, God. What am I controlling here? Oh, I'm a, I'm a blinky thing. Let's go to Burger King. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, we've got... Oh, God. Whoa. Hey, now. All right. Well, okay. All right. 
Oh, hey, hold on. Can I hit him? Get fucked. Get fucked. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Why are my little firecrackers not doing anything? How the f... Wait, what? What am I can... Why can't I go up the stairs? Tangy Pop, what have you done to me? <laughs> what is this? Up and down aims? Oh. What? Doesn't make any sense. This game's awful. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, we're fucking... We got Shaggy from Scooby-Doo trying to run away from a naked man and rats. This game sucks. How do you... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Tangy Pop, this is awful. You wanna play a Wii game that isn't $60? That... Uh... That sounds like a pipe dream. Every retro game is like a billion dollars now, and it sucks. All right, can I? Ah! Tangy Pop, I hate this more than life itself, and I don't understand how this is supposed to work at all. I'm getting real good at throwing rocks. Is that Michael Myers up there? <laughs> I hit him with a rock. Okay. How do you... How... Wait, what... Trouble 3? Is it the name of the level, or like, am I in trouble? This uh, this music is awful, too. I- Oh my god! <laughs> Which- there we go, that's the C button. So it was a Mac game with mouse aim. When they ported it to console, they made up and down rotate the arm. Yeah, yeah, fucking up and down rotates the arm. Okay. I don't understand anything else I'm supposed to be doing. Or why I'm- Fuck! God! How... I keep dying because I'm falling down the stairs! How do I stop falling down the stairs? Oh, 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 oh! Do we do it? Hit the- Hit the Michael Myers. Hit the bat. Boom. Boom. How do I- no, 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 no. Hit the Michael. Hit. Oh, he has a gun? Oh my god. <laughs> Tangy Pop. And pausing does not turn off the music. Can we. T turn the turn this off. Tur tur <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. The music is not off. Hold on. Can anybody hear that? Is that just me? Is it the emulator or is it the fucking game? Cause there's still, there's like a do, still going. Tangy Pop, this game sucks. <laughs> just, just run. Yeah, let's turn the difficulty up. Actually, hold on. Just run past that man. I can't. You don't understand, dude. <laughs> game, game feel is the hardest thing to, like. Uh, describe to somebody who's not currently why did that go through him? Why did that not hit the mouse? Hit the mouse. Oh My god, dude Eat shit. Bye. I Can't go. How do I climb this ladder? Oh, okay. Well that fuck <laughs> This sucks so bad <laughs> Oh you found Super Mario Galaxy for the Wii for 15 bucks and you bought it immediately? Dude, that kind of shit makes me so glad I did most of my video game collecting when I was younger and had, like, a disposable income of some type. Because, like, goddamn, dude, I couldn't imagine trying to, like, even when I find a game that's like, ooh, I don't have this one, that's cool. They're like, $35 for it and you can have it. It's like, man, I don't want it then. That's too much money for this fucking shitty game. So, anyway... Yeah, this game sucks, and also it froze. It's broken. That... I get to quit now. <laughs> I, I get to not play it anymore. Jesus Christ. And cousin, you had the, this game in your youth. It was a running joke that any bad game could never be as bad as Dark Castle. I mean, fuck, man, that sucked, dude. You still get Mario Galaxy 2 sealed for $20? I don't think so anymore. Uh, that may have been true a couple years ago.
Though notably, I did I did hear a story about how in September of this year, uh, there was one brand new Wii U that was sold. <laughs> so people are still buying Wii U's. I'm glad I have mine. Okay, uh, fuck it. We're just going to go in order now, I guess. This one. Sure, who cares? <laughs> That sure is a way to start the game. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> Chuck Max Decap has emerged from the underworld to invade our world. Come on, Chuck. Now's the time to show your stuff. Who the fuck are any of these people? Why does that... Why does that guy look like King Hippo? <laughs> anybody's foolish enough to do so. Oh, this guy definitely sounds like, be careful, Chuck. Now's the time to test your power, Chuck. <laughs> okay. This is Decap Attack starring Chuck D-Head. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Honestly, this kind of rules. I don't know what the fuck's going on there. Who, like, who that duck is or who the angry frog is. Like, let's just... It's got me fucking hyped. This is way better. Abdomen... Ab... Abdom... Abdomen land? Oh, God. Use the cursor and choose an item. I don't have any items, I think. Alright. Ooh. Ooh, this feels bad. <laughs> and this happens when I push this button. I sure hate that. Alright, let's go. <laughs> yup, up, up. Well, that's fine, I guess. You're looking at East Starland site and they don't have it in stock new anymore? Yeah. I don't think they make... I don't think they sell uh, physical Wii games anymore, man. Just <laughs> just in general. Uh, and also, a lot of places are going to stop selling physical games entirely. So I, I imagine uh, retro gaming is about to get even more fucking expensive, unfortunately. Uh, again, another reason why I'm very glad I did my retro game shopping when I was younger. <laughs> it was fun. Kid Chameleon is better and similar. It only passes horror on the surface. I mean, this feels very horror, right? Oh, oh. There's a wolfman. A ghost. I mean, I guess this really was the... What? Oh, oh. That's fun. I can, I can do a little kickies to slow my fall. Oh. I feel like this really was indicative of the state of horror in this time period. As it wasn't a game trying to scare you as much as it was a game trying to, like, come off <laughs> as, like, a decoration, you know? Like, this is, this is a game inspired by Halloween decorations as opposed to a game inspired to, like, scare you. Which is fine. Nothing against that. I think it would be cool to see something like it nowadays. On, like, modern hardware. But there goes me being a little idiot again, because I would love to see a shit ton of... Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, hang on. These are platforms. I didn't know that. I, uh... I wish gaming could go back to being a landscape that was just, like, crazy fun ideas given form. You know? As opposed to, we are making a sequel to this game because it's what will sell and it's what we want, and that's what we want to do. So, I just, I like, I like dumb creative ideas. And the indie scene is kind of there, but with horror in the indie scene, you, you get a lot of, like, walking simulators with jump scares peppered in, and not a lot of, like, silly goofy shit, you know? Or if it is silly goofy, it's, like, too over-the-top silly goofy. Like, fucking poop killer. Like that that whole thing where it's just trying to be really silly and dumb. What the fuck is that? Why do I have this? I don't know if any of my ramblings even make sense, honestly. I found a head. But I also have a head? This is very confusing. But I'm having fun. This is definitely much more playable than Dark Castle, so it's got points there. Oh, oh, oh. We... I gotta catch up on chat. Oh boy, hi Jazz, thank you for joining me and thank you for redeeming the worm, you little early bird. There you go. <laughs> K 
Kid Kamehameha is basically the Genesis version of that Goosebumps where the kid gets stuck in the arcade. Oh. Isn't that just Tron? I don't know. <laughs> Why do you hate Kid Chameleon, Iggy? What did he ever do to you? Fuck! No, my skull! <laughs> okay, well... Now I'm blind. This is gonna be really... Uh... Oh, I did it! I can... <laughs> my blind eyes can see that says 1-1 one, one goal, so that's fine. <laughs> okay. Uh... Okay, okay, this is fine. Please, you gotta be, you gotta be scared is the thing. Maybe, and maybe that's the secret to making this game scary is not being able to see it. Cause now you're just kind of at the mercy of the game and whatever the fuck it decides to do. And you gotta take things much more cautiously. Yeah, that's, okay. That's the secret. That's the secret sauce. Please stop shooting me with arrows. I think my wife is having a dance party in my chat. I can't tell because I can't see! Oh no. <laughs> oh god. Oh, do they also have the little witches hats when they bounce around the screen? Ah, oh, dude, how forgiving of a game this is. It starts me off at level two. God. This is going well. Speedrun strats. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. No. Speedrun strats. Failing me. I'm still a god gamer even without my glasses. Beep, beep. Just don't bonk me on the head. Okay, okay, this is fine. God, I didn't even hear that. <laughs> The jump scare didn't even fucking work. Because the game was so loud. God, okay. I think... I think I'm doing great, though. <laughs> I, how the fuck am I supposed to do this? Well... What the hell was that? Okay. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do anymore. Oh, that's a platform. Okay. We're doing great. Fuck you. Ow. Fuck. Oh, hell yeah, dude. I got head. I got head now. Can I shoot head up? Nope, I just lost it. Forever. Oh, there it is. It's back. This game's great, dude. Why didn't we get 17 sequels to Decap Attack? Hmm? Why did we get fucking 30 Mario games and no more Decap Attack games? That's the real fucking question. Why did we get 18 fucking Sonic games and zero Decap Attack games? Fuck! I can see! Oh. I can see again. Beautiful. Oh, Jesus. Now to see what everybody was doing this whole time. What kind of nonsense were you guys up to this whole time? <laughs> so, so many things. Jesus Christ, guys. Okay, anyway, thank you for that. Uh, what do we think? Do we keep playing this? I like this. I might... Alright, I like that less. Do I like this? I don't know if I like this. <laughs> it's like, fine. It does control very weirdly. Like, everything is so slippery. And I don't know if that's by design. I also don't know what any... I don't know what anything is happening. I don't know what anything is. Ah! I mean, we'll go until we get, like, a game over, I think, is what we're gonna do. I don't know... Uh, I don't know if timers are working for me. We'll, uh... We'll treat it like continue. The YouTube show. <laughs> Where after a certain amount of time, I'll see if I want to continue playing, or if I just want to fucking kill myself instead. Um... <laughs> I wonder which one wins. Um, anyway. Oh my god, dude. Fucking we're kings at this. We're not. I mean, the the problem is, is that would require us to actually fuck. That really, that really set me back. Uh, that would require us to actually get a game over in this. And since we can see now, we're not we're not going to be doing that. 
<laughs> yeah, in Minecraft. <laughs> up, up. Okay, well. Well, that might be the end of our time with decap attack, actually. Decap actually attack. What the fuck is that? <laughs> I don't even know what this is. I don't, I don't know what this is. This is a weird fucking game, though, and I don't hate it. I don't hate it. It controls a little weird. It's got a lot of pizzazz, and I respect it for all of its pizzazz. Uh, all right. All right. All right. All right. We're going to play, fucking, I don't know, something. This one, I guess. <laughs> you just click around the screen, and then something happens, and it's cool. So I remember I played this one uh, a lot when I worked at a video game store. It has been so long. So very long. I have hunted evil for no less than a thousand years. Oh, there's a spider web on my microphone. Yet I remember well how the pain started. As though it were just yesterday. When my blood was warm, I was a great warrior. No, okay. Um, alright, we're just gonna go. No more story for us. With sword and spell, we clash toe to toe. Okay, so I used to play this game a lot uh, at the, the video game store I used to work at because they had like a demo of it set up or something and it was just a thing you could do. Uh, and I remember really enjoying my time with it then. I don't know if it's actually good or if, it, if I still think it's good or what, but I remember liking it a lot. Because it was very like, yeah, look at him go. That shit rules, dude. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Shaka Khan, exactly, dude. You're so right. I have no idea how to. I don't remember how to do anything. I just remember really enjoying how fucking fast he stabs. <laughs> oh, there. Come on now. What the fuck is going on? Jump up. There we go. We're going to ascend the stairs. I guess. It's very jittery. Much more jittery than I remember it being. Whoa! Did I do it? Fast stabbing man got a motherfucking plan. Hell yeah, that's what I want people to say about me. Whoa, 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 Roby guys. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> whoa. Stabbing ghost, baby. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck? Stop! Go away! Jesus. Uh. Whoa, yeah! Fuck you! Fuck you! Ow. Stop! Okay, this is fine. <laughs> Alright, let's try that again. <laughs> We gotta watch out for the ghosty guys right away. Platforming, my one weakness. No, I have many weaknesses. Ow. I have many weaknesses, including these guys. Fuck! That fucking rules, dude. Okay. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Don't worry about it. We we gotta go. We gotta go. Fuck you. Oh yeah, dude. The field goal is good. Boom. Boom. <laughs> hey ho, let's go over here and down. Okay. <laughs> don't fucking don't fucking come at my skills, dude. Oh yeah, dude, look at that hitbox! That rules! Nothing gets through me! I guess I could just do this too. Okay, I think that's I think they're infinite. I think the thing with the bats is they're forever. I think the bats are here forever. Ip, 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 ip. I have great skill with a blade. Um Um Oh, I can get up. Uh, I can be on these. I'm. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm a god. I timed that so perfectly. <laughs> Sounds like you're wiping your car windows. It kind of does. Just. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, wow. 
Okay, watch out for the monkeys. I don't know why there's monkeys, but there are. All right, that's not my fault. That's not fair. Stupid game. All right. We're doing great, though. Hopefully there's no more ghosties to fucking come at me with their fucking shitty plan. I'm, like, running out of time in the bottom right? I don't know what that means. Oh, come on! Why are there a million bats here? Also, oh my god, dude, what the fuck? Go away! <laughs> oh, you can breathe fire too? Jesus Christ. This is a fucking Dark Souls game, dude. Give me the potion. Give me the potion. What, what did that do? I can point, ooh. Look at my cool little inventory. You don't, don't even think about accessing that potion though. You can't, you can't use it. You do have it. It's there, taunting you. But you cannot use this potion, whatever you do. I don't, <laughs> I should, I should have learned how to play this game, I think. <laughs> this one feels like there's a bit of a learning curve to it. And I definitely don't, why are there so many walls here? I don't remember there being that many walls. Uh, Alien 3 is horror theme. I mean, Alien 3 is just a horror game, right? Wouldn't, uh... Wouldn't that just count as a horror game? Because it's, like, licensed? My god! I fucking hate these ghost men! What game is this? It's called Sh Shakan? Shakan? I think? C-H-A... Oh my god. Jesus fuck, dude! Go, 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 go! No, no, no! I can't let him hurt me! Okay, okay! <laughs> It's not, it's not Shaka Khan, I promise you. There we go, you gotta like push up to do the little Sonic the Hedgehog dive. Oh my god. But it is the best way to get out of things and the best way to stab some ghosts in the dick. I have been here before, I think. Either that or the level design here is uh, a problem. Fuck. Oh, sometimes you don't have to do push up to get the Sonic the Hedgehog jump. Um, yeah, it looks cool. It's rough. It <laughs> I'm, I'm out. I think it's interesting, and I think it has some, like, stuff going on. I would have to understand what I'm doing or what's going on or what, but it does feel like a fun little stabby platformy kind of deal. Anyway... Uh, let's go ahead and, let's go ahead and do one of the bigger ones. One of the, one of the cool ones. One of the big, cool, interesting ones that I really want to do because it's Halloween. Uh, it's Spooktober, baby. Haunted by guilt and tormented by nightmares. Nightmares of... Jennifer screams in the infernal temptations of the mask. There's Kermit right there, screaming for help. <laughs> She doesn't have to die, Rick. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> we can save her. Go back to the house. game assumes I'm a slow reader, but I'm actually a really fast reader, so it can move a little bit quicker, you know? We get it, we get it. Spooky, spooky house, spooky mask, uh, ropes and a tree. Fucking whatever, man. Move on. Move on. We get it. Okay. Splatterhouse 2. <laughs> Let's fucking go, dude. I, I love the Splatterhouse games. Like I said, I have a fond connection to the, the PS3 360 one, uh, because I played it a lot. Uh, I don't know if I've ever really sat down and played any of the... Oh, it's just like we're taking a whiz. Fucking don't mind me. Alright. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever played any of these, but my god, is it fucking gruesome looking. Ew! Alright, punch him in half. That's cool. Get fucked. Get out of here. I'm actually a super fast reader. They always ask me to read in school because I read super fast. <laughs> I'm such a fast reader boy, says teacher. <laughs> That's the notes that came home with me from school. Yeah, you're so right. What is it? Whoa, 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 whoa! Ew, ew, ew! 
Don't fucking shoot urethra monsters at me. Hey, hey! Don't fucking come at me. Oh yeah, we gotta... We gotta avoid that. Dude, he's so fucking buff. Get fucked! Yeah! Get fucked! <laughs> this is so cool. This game rules, dude. Alright, well we're gonna hop over that, I guess. Uh, is that gonna drop from the ceiling? I knew it, dude! I fucking knew it! I, I know game design. I'm a smart boy. Urethra monsters. <laughs> More like my urethra monsters. <laughs> I, hey, what? No. <laughs> Oh, no, no, no! Give me my pipe back! A boy needs his pipe! I'll really show these fucking urethra monsters how I lay pipe! Alright. <laughs> That's enough penis jokes for now, I think. Ooh. I suck at this. <laughs> I'm really bad at most fucking video games. Why are there two jump buttons? You this Friday the 13th game looks sick, AF. <laughs> it does. I feel like, uh, did they have to, like, change his mask somewhat to, like, make it legally distinct? I feel like the mask had to go undergo some redesigns so that they could get away with this shit. Whoa now. Oh. Get fucking kicked, baby. Oh. Oh, 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 that's actually some good game design shit right there. Ooh, ooh, okay. Okay, uh, we, we paused it because I want I want to talk about that. So this is the first pit you come across, right, with the little jumpy fucking monsters, right? And yeah, like as a gamer, I fully understand, like yeah, I should jump over that. But what this game does is, as it introduces it to you, it shows this monster over here on the right, who's about to walk into it and get eaten up, and then it stops your progress by show by giving you something something to fight on the left, so that you have to turn around to fight that giving you the time to see that this monster's gonna fall into the pit and show you how that works. It's some good shit. That's some good design, though. It, it, shut the fuck up, it's not boring. <laughs> Don't fucking call me boring. It's mean. It's too mean. <laughs> okay, we're gonna ignore that, I guess. He just eats that guy. And then you see them, and they drop. They give you a little wiggle first before they drop, so it's not unfair. You just gotta be paying attention a little bit, and then it gives you one that you want to position yourself in between. Boom. Just make a YouTube video about it already. About one tiny little fucking game design thing in a game nobody cares about. I don't. I don't think <laughs> even you didn't care about enough about it to let me finish talking about it. <laughs> no one's gonna care. <laughs> That's what YouTubers do. That is not what YouTubers do. Hello? Who are all these people? What's happening? Am I this guy? Oh no. He's just scared of me. He fucking should be, dude. Whoa! Fucking ew! Whoa! Okay. Ew! Oh. The puddle lingers. Oh god, dude. Woo! Now I'm doing it. Ah, I'm not doing it very well. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> YouTubers lie to you about Sonic the Hedgehog? Do they now? I've never been lied to about Sonic the Hedgehog. You're watching the wrong YouTubers if you're... Oh. Was that... Was that that easy to cheese? <laughs> you just stay up next to him and punch the hell out of him. Whoa! That looks like a totally different thing. <laughs> a secret entrance to the house? Maybe. They find little unknown games and stay stuff only nerds like, This is not an unknown game. It's just a game nobody cares about. <laughs> People know about it, they just don't give a shit. Whoa. Ah! Fuck, these guys are hard to punch, dude. I wish I had my metal pipe. Ah, ah. I like how, I like how they just leave. <laughs> I'll say anything to get out of making videos. I just I don't have anything else to say about a game. It would be a one second video. <laughs> Whoa. 
there's no video to be made about it because I don't have more things to say. Oh, I am having fun. What's up with this purple guy? Ah! Make it a short profit? Maybe. I feel like, like there could be something there, but I'd have to really fucking think about it more. <laughs> Hey, what the fuck is happening in the background, by the way? Jesus Christ. Uh, it's at least as long as TikTok. Yeah, maybe I could do something like that. Uh, though in my experience, TikToks that talk about like a tiny aspect of game design like that are very unpopular. But we, we'll see. You want to make a good Stranger Things game? Um, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> the jump arc is a little fucky in this, for sure. It's a little, a little shorter than you'd think it would be. I mean, it's because the sprite's so fucking massive, so I get it, but... Fuck off. <laughs> Great gameplay design in games no one cares about. Uh, if I call it that and then say... and the, If other people hear me say this game is a game no one cares about, then they're gonna get mad at me. <laughs> Though it is true, nobody fucking cares about Splatterhouse in the year 2023. What, what would make a good Stranger Things game, Iggy? Ah, shit, I should have paid attention to where I was going. Get fucked. Ah, oh, punched in the nards. Ah, oh, he punched me right back. I deserve it. What, what kind of things would make a good Stranger Things game? I don't really... I, I, I struggle to think of something that would work for that. Oh, God, he has such range, dude. Get punched. You know, stay out of range of his little jab. Fuck yeah. 64 bit that has more spooky. That has spooky, more realistic cutscenes? Maybe. Ah, mm. oh, fuck you. I hate those spike pits, dude. Shit sucks. Alright, I don't know how I made it through that unscathed, but that's fine. Mm. Fuck you! Huh. Oh, you're scared of me. You're scared of me! Get the fuck out of here. Ooh, give me a bone! Give me a bone! Okay, god damn it. <laughs> I got too excited for a bone. Retry. What the fuck? Oh, that's the code. <laughs> it's like, what the fuck does that say at the bottom? That's that's the code to probably get back to this point of the game. Okay. So that's Splatterhouse 2. I I like that. I like I like what it's doing. Uh if I wanted to like fully deep dive into it, I think that could be really interesting, but. Uh, just as of right now, it's just a fun little little thing we found in the trash. You know what I'm saying? I like it. A short indie-esque time loop game will be cool for Stranger Things. General map of the town. You can get places on bikes. Missions like Go to Party, where you find the pics a guy took or whatever, then follow clues to advance the story. Yeah, I guess I could see it. Uh, I think uh, it's one of those things where I like I'm not. As I, like, you know, traverse through this life, I'm far more interested in new stories. Uh, so I would rather just see a game like that that isn't tied to Stranger Things. You know what I mean? Where it's telling its own story. Uh, but then again, I guess a lot of those, like, games that are even tied to, like, big IPs like that tend to tell their own stories anyway. So that, maybe there's something there. I don't know. That wasn't the prompt. <laughs> I'm just saying, if, if, if something like that would be really cool, I just think it would be really interesting if it wasn't tied to Stranger Things, or if it was, like, Stranger Things adjacent, which a lot of, I guess, those movie ty game tie-in things are. So, anyway. Oh, God. The prompt was to do a Stranger Things IP. It's a game where you... Uh, run around and you punch the Demogorgon in the balls. You do it three times and then you get a cool hat. That That's my pitch for a Stranger Things game. I hope they pick it up. Splatterhouse 3. I don't know what's different about this. Except that definitely looks like just a picture of a real-ass house. <laughs> oh, this was made in 1993, dude. Same. Do a specific little possum boy game. This made for me. That's every prompt. You... If you wander aimlessly, you will surely fail in your quest. I'm a spooky little mask. Look at me glow. After completing a room, press the start button to reveal a map of the current floor. 
Let me just tell you how to play this video game. I'm still a creepy mask. Gather the power stones and save them for emergencies. Any more gameplay tip? The power of these stones can be released with the A button. You know where the A button is, don't you? You little baby. Whence your flesh will expand with a surge of power. You can store those power stones inside your ball sack. Okay. This is, we don't care. <laughs> Mansion first floor, whatever. Stage one. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Look at me, I'm so much quicker now. Ooh, and I have three dimensions. Whoa! Dude, hell yeah! Hell yeah, I have a jump kick! Okay, this one's way better. <laughs> that last one was cool, but this one's way better. Jennifer cowers in hiding, avoiding capture from the monster. Am I the monster? Maybe. That definitely just looks like a picture of a woman. Again, like th this... Is that a power stone? Ooh, yeah, baby! Get fucked up. Get fucked up. Get fucked. I like I One of those hits is definitely to the balls, dude. Oh. I thought stuff was gonna come out. I thought this was like Turtles in Time shit. Where stuff was gonna come out of the door. Whoa, 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 whoa! Easy now. Come on. Come on! Face me, cowards! Aww. Oh. Oh, you're nothing. You're nothing, dude. I punch you in the dick seven times and then you die? Oh, look at these little dudes. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Owie, dude. Not cool. Get fucking jump kicked. Fucking ouch, dude. Video called You'll Never Hate a Doctor for this weird reason? What? <laughs> Ultimate clickbait. Come here, fucker. Punch him right in the balls. I love how much ball punching there is in this game, dude. Yeah, fuck you. Get thrown. Oh, come here. Ow. Get fucking. Whoa, what did I do? What the fuck is going on? This rules! Is that the Power Stone thing he was talking about? <laughs> Hell yeah, that was awesome. I should have saved that. <laughs> Trying to learn Leyenda on guitar? I don't know that song. I like I just I don't even recognize the word, so. Ow. So definitely good luck to you. Oh no. What? Pup, pup. <laughs> video called Top 5 Reasons You Shouldn't Click This Video. Ugh, that's very BuzzFeedy. It's definitely, <laughs> that's some BuzzFeed type shit. <laughs> Alright, through this door. Dude, look how fucking cheeked up he is. Hell yeah. What is happening in this room? What is this? Huh? Okay, this is just this spooky skull room. Oh god. Hi. I hate them. Get jump kicked. Ah, don't spit on me, no. He's gonna spit. He's gonna spit. He's full of it. Get out. Go, go, go. Fuck you. Oh, there we go. What is this? Oh, is that life? That must be life. Go. Oh. Cool. Power stone. Power stone. I'm fully lost in this area. I don't know where the fuck I'm going. <laughs> Jennifer begins to smell of rot of the grave. Jennifer. Or, no, that was... Okay, she's speaking. She said... Uh. <laughs> 1892 Spanish composer. That explains why I've never heard of whatever the fuck you're talking about, Tangy Pop. I don't listen to old music. I only listen to cool music, dude. Are you real? You're real! Dude, this game kicks ass. This game rips shit. <laughs> I fucking love this. <laughs> oh, fuck. That's so many guys. Aw, oh, eat uppercut, bitch. Fuck yeah! Woo! 
Get punched! <laughs> oh yeah, I'm real. Huh? Did everyone else see that? What the hell was that? What the hell was the little fucking hand pointing out from underneath my thing? Oh my god, I'm running out of time. I didn't know that was a thing. Oh god. Ow, don't. Okay, you're, you still exist. What if I throw you? Ah, <laughs> bye. <laughs> Later, dog. Okay, I guess I have to kill them. Come on. Fuck you, come on! Oh my god. Those little fucking gremlin monsters, dude. Hate them. Oh, you thought you were gonna get me with your little gross hand. But then you got jump kicked to death. How's that fucking feel? Hell yeah. <laughs> when you're playing in a large auditorium for 25,000 people, you'll remember me. <laughs> you'll remember me think it's not cool. I didn't say you're not cool, I just said I only listen to cool guy music. If it's new cool guy music that I haven't heard, then that's different, you know? See, that's how I get around saying stupid shit like that. <laughs> oh, he got me. Oh, not if I corner him, though. This is exactly like Turtles in Time, dude. Turtles in Time! Okay. <laughs> Oh, wait, am I barefoot? The monster emits a foul smell and moves closer to Jennifer. Okay. I assume this is happening in the same house that I'm in or something, because <laughs> otherwise I don't know why you're telling me that. <laughs> Ew. Oh, that definitely looks like something that would emit a foul odor. Ew. Fuck off. Alright, Power Stone time, I guess. <laughs> Come here, you fuck! Get fucked! Get fucked! Get punched! Oh my god, I'm running out of Power Stone! Eep. I should try and punch it on the same layer as the enemy. I'm trying! He's hard! He's hard to punch! This a lumpy baby man does not want to get punched by me. I think it's like his whole thing. Fuck! There we go. I assume this is doing something when I give him a big old hug. Whoa! Whoa! Usually when their head is gone, that means they're dead, but not this guy. Holy shit! Oh! Oh! Oh, now you're bringing the fight to me and losing! Oh, buddy. Oh, <laughs> you should have kept avoiding me. Okay, th throw a whole fucking fit about it, I guess. Do we do it? Do we win? Rick stands in front of Jennifer's lifeless body. No! Jennifer, no! She died or whatever. He's killed her. Use your rage against him. Okay. This music's fucking bumping, though. Rick climbs the stairs to the second floor, his rage growing with each step. <laughs> this is rules, dude. Tuxedo mask got ripped. Hell yeah, dude. Look at the fucking tattered sleeves he's wearing that he's definitely not wearing in the other part of the game. <laughs> With that tongue sticking out of a neck stump, do? Oh god. <laughs> whoa, 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 you can't just start me getting punched. That's cheating, game. You punch this ugly alien, man. Okay, we're gonna have to stop playing this game at some point, but this is so fucking... This kicks ass. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> I might just play more Splatterhouse 3 when we're when we're done. When we're done today. Cause this just fucking rules. Hell yeah. And I can jump for joy. Uh yeah, cool. Rick, you will suffer. You will die just like your pre preckless preckless wife. <laughs> They have an I that is absolutely an L. Rick, ignore it. The 
evil one is using telepathy to stop you. You want me to rub... What the fuck did you... Spend all my time playing video games and not rubbing his wife's fart? Furt? Feet? Did you try and type feet and that's what happened? Also, I rub your feet all the time. <laughs> what the hell? Don't just lie to these people. I'm nice to my wife, damn it. She's my preckless wife, and I love her very much. I would absolutely put on an evil demonic mask and punch a gross monster for her. Just like Rick's doing here. Whoa, 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 give me that heart. Yum. He says as he yells at his wife. <laughs> I love you! It's like that fucking clip of- Whoa, whoa, ah! Hey, 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 hey! Whoa now, I don't like that! I guess we just leave, though, because I can't hit him. <laughs> Alright. Stop! 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 Ah, God! Oh my God, dude, how do I get out of this handstorm? Fuck! Okay, 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 I guess we- all right, okay, just just a couple more. Yep, okay, just a couple. All right. <laughs> just just gonna, just gonna take a couple. <laughs> just to Rude's handstorm. God, that would that sounds like a fucking D&D &D spell for sure, and it would absolutely do this. God. You've cast Darude's legendary handstorm. <laughs> Let me get the book, dude. This is just like going to the library, dude. This sucks. Oh my god. Oh my god. Why is this happening to me? And only me. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? What if I get what if I use a power stone? I can't even I can't even access a power stone. I can't. <laughs> oh my god. Are they even hurting me, or are they just knocking me around? Try crawling. I can't crawl. Okay, okay. I guess I guess you just kind of... You gotta duck and weave. You gotta duck and roll. And then get the fuck out of here. God damn. Yo, that sucked. <laughs> ooh, ooh, give me the brick. Uh, give me the brick. Get mashed. Get mashed with brick. Hell yeah. Brick. Okay. <laughs> what, you don't get attacked by hands when you go to the library? Uh, you haven't been in a while, I guess, so that, that explains things. God, get the fuck out of here. Nasty boy. You stole my brick! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you are weak. You have not the power to defeat me. So the evil one and the evil mask are different things and they... What, they're both evil? This, uh, this story is kind of unnecessarily confusing, I think. <laughs> Get fucked! Yeah, th thank you for the clip. There was a lot that happened there, so I'm sure it'll be fun to dig through whatever the fuck was going on. Oh, oh, hold on. Hold on, creepy hand. There's a fucking guy down here. You really want me to fucking get got from behind, huh? I only have two minutes to find my wife. You can hit guys with... Oh, my God. Yeah, you can... If you get close enough, you'll throw them, and it's fucking cool. Where is he? Or am I just not at the door? Okay. Whoa. The music is like sliding between the left and the right headphone and it's very weird. Okay. I hate these little gremlin men. Yeah! Get fucked! <laughs> Boom. Fuck you guys. Fuck you guys. And all your little friends. Eat fist. <laughs> Aww. Aww. You, guys, you mean you guys have to get on screen to do something? Mm, what if I don't let that happen? What if I just fucking punch you in the dick right before you get to me? Dude, too easy. You can punch their dicks apart. You cannot win. Okay. Then I won't play. Pfft, easy. 
Can't win, don't play. Fuck! Why do they get a free shot at me? Why do they get to fucking punch me before I can even fucking live? My life. Get fucked. Ew, ew, nasty boys. Nasty babies. They do kind of look like the jelly baby from Resident Evil 8. A little bit. But with, like, hands instead of flippers. Did that baby have flippers? I think that baby had flippers. Oh, okay. We desperately need a heart. Something just happened over here, I guess, though. I guess... I don't remember which way we came. No! I have bad memories of being up there. <laughs> We're going. Ah, oh, dude, I'm fucked. <laughs> I only have 30 seconds to find it where I'm supposed to go. Oh god, hi. I mean, I may as well do this, right? If I'm gonna lose everything anyway. Give me a hug. Give me your lunch money, you ugly fucking guy. All right. Hopefully she's through this door. Oh, she's not. Just more of these fucking goobers, man. Get fucked. You guys can't even do anything. Useless. You're just here to get punched. Whoa, how did you hit me? That's fine, I have several lives. We're definitely out of time, though, whatever that means. Ow. They hit hard, dude. Even though they shouldn't be able to hit me at all, because I'm getting them real fucking good right in the goocher, dude. Okay. Ooh, heart. Ooh, heart. There we go. <laughs> this way, I guess. I don't know where I'm going. You belong in the abyss, and I will send you there. <laughs> Okay. We're gonna find out what it means that we ran out of time and then we will move on to a different game because we should probably do that at some point. Oh god. Give me a fucking power stone. Ow, ow, am I hurting them or are they hurting me? I can't fucking tell sometimes. Uh, but that's like a problem with most beat em ups actually, so I can't even really blame the game for that. I can, however, blame myself for everything that's wrong in my life. Fuck off! Get shit on! Get shit out of an ass! There we go... Nope, nope, nope. This one? That did it. Super Sonic Racing. Oh my god! <laughs> bam, bam. Bam, bam, there's a whole room of them. Why are there so many little dudes in here? Thank you for the vibe, Ziggy. I appreciate that. Did we... Did we do it? Ah! Oh, I'm just a little man now. Little is subjective. He's still a giant. I hate these! Oh my god. Oh no, dude! <laughs> Why? Why are there hands everywhere? Why are you going to do this to me? Mm, I hate them. Okay, bye. We did it. Whoa, uh, hi. Oh, shit. He fucking blocked. Whoa, 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 whoa. Y'all are not fucking around, are you? Y'all are like the boss from the original, from that first level. But there's more of you now. Fuck. I'm going to die here for sure. I should have saved my power beans for this fucking jam. Ah! His face melted off. That's fine, I guess. His face melted off too. Gross. Come here. <laughs> ah! Whoa! What a nightmare! You can't block everything. You can't block everything. That one's fucking freaking out. How did you get me? Not fair! Not fair! I gotta hit you with a mix-up. Overhead strike. There we go. Now I'm talking fighting game terms. He's having a bad time. Okay. This way, I guess. I still don't know where I'm going. There's a brick in here, though, so we're gonna take it.
Does the does the ghosty heads mean I'm like close or something? Like I don't understand. I don't understand what those are. I'm still definitely out of time, but like, well, I imagine the ghosty heads mean I'm close because there's ghosty heads. Stop stealing my brick! Oh my god! Or maybe it doesn't mean anything and they're just here to steal my brick. That sucks. I think I made a circle. I super don't know where to go now, though. Is there a, is there a map or something? There is! Oh, ho, 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 ho. I see. I should have been pushing the pause button to check my map. God damn, dude. Ow. Fuck. Ow. Okay, we died. It's it's fine. We died again. We're we're done with that one. <laughs> Very cool game though. I'm I'm really into that. Like that that's really fucking fun. I like that one a lot. Okay, we're actually gonna take a quick break, go to the bathroom and such, uh, and then when I come back, we'll play some more weird shit probably. There's there's plenty of more weird shit to play, so we'll be back. Okay, bye. We're back. Hello. Uh, hi, Fairy King. Thank you for joining us. Uh, still an early bird, still here early enough to get yourself a worm. There you go. Enjoy. Uh, thanks for being here. We are working our way through some Sega Genesis horror games. Horror in quotes, because a lot of these retro games are just kind of horror themed as opposed to like scary. But I'm having a really good time. We just finished playing. Let's see, which ones did we play through? Did we played some of some one called Dark Castle, which sucked. Uh, one called Decap Attack, which kind of also sucked. Uh, another one and some other ones, but then we played the Splatterhouse games, which, if you haven't seen them, very fucking cool. Splatterhouse 2 was fun. I definitely had a little more fun with Splatterhouse 3, more like a beat em up Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Turtles in Time kind of vibe. Very fun, though. Everything, yeah, everything is looking, uh, looking fucking great after playing Dark Castle. That was awful. Alien 3 is neat. I don't have Alien 3, but I do have Bram Stoker's Dracula. And that's what we're going to play next. I It's probably bad. <laughs> going to be real with you. But we can... We can try. Gross. Is it bad? I don't know anything about this movie. Because it's definitely based on, like, the movie that came out around this time. I don't know shit about this movie, and I don't know shit about this game. Let's go, though. I like the color palette already. Fucking buy pride. Am I right, boys? I <laughs> love this already. I stand a bisexual fucking game. Here we go. Is that perfect cell? Whoa. Okay, Bram Stoker's Dragon. This is starting out interesting. And it was by Sony. Ooh, but this is be Okay, yeah, because this is before they entered the game market themselves. Oh, hold on. Spoilers. That looked awful. Here we go. I can't wait. <laughs> huh? Why are you starting me with options? Hard, normal, trainer? I want maximum lives... No, I want maximum lives and maximum health. What are you talking about? Don't give me these options if I don't get to do it. Huh? Sword missile jump, jump sword missile... That's not a good sign. A game should know its own control scheme. <laughs> Vampire. A game should have its own control scheme kind of ironed out before it asks if you want to change it or not. The journey to Castle Dracula. <laughs> it's got such a... Whoa, I just murdered a dude. Uh, it's got such a fucking... Okay. This is just like shitty Castlevania, isn't it? Yeah, where you just murder dudes. That's fun. This is just... Yeah, this is just bad Castlevania. Okay, that's fine. I'm fine with that, I guess. The music is so fucking plinky and plonky, though. This <laughs> it sounds so bad. 
And also there's an arrow in the middle of my screen for some reason? I do not understand why that's there. Or not the middle of- oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god! I just got fucking ganked, dude. <laughs> I, I, I hate- oh god, the music continues through the pause. I hate that too. I fucking hate when games have bad, like, hit uh, feedback. Where you can just get hit and then hit again and again and again. It's- it's the fucking worst. Okay. I need to fight something other than bats. Wh huh? What? Um... <laughs> what? Okay, now the arrow- oh, okay, I had to talk to that guy. All he told me was pointy. He just told me a thing was pointy. Ah! Why do they turn into farts? What? Oh god. Ooh, ah, ooh, god, why does this spider look like that? This game is Whoa! <laughs> I didn't even think that was gonna be a thing that could happen. Okay, is... Is a lot of the red, st the brown stuff actually supposed to be red? Is that something that's happening here? Is it something wrong with the game, or is it some weird censorship stuff? Because now that I'm looking at the fire, I feel like the fire is supposed to be red. I think the little potion bottles at the bottom are also supposed to be red, or they're just filled with chocolate milk. I don't, I don't fucking know, I guess. And then the guys who turn into a fart when they die are supposed to be like puffs of, ah, uh, God, blood, maybe. Oh my God. Big chocolate- why is there a big chocolate milk on the screen? Whoa! Whoa! What the fuck are you? Am I doing something? I- I- okay. What about now? Oh, now I'm definitely doing something. This is working great. Oh, the big chocolate milk is his health. On the journey to civilization. All right. Whoa, bone horse. Yeah, so far this is just really bad, really bad Castlevania, which is fine. Like I've played worse. We played worse today. Dark Castle was way worse than this, but this is just bad Castlevania. Ow. Odd colors. Everything's the wrong color, and I don't understand why. <laughs> I fully don't. Can I hop on these buckets? I can, dude. Hell yeah. Here we go. Alright, that's not... Oh, I can hop on that. It also does a very, very bad job. Huh? It does a very bad job of telling you what you can and cannot jump on. Fuck you, little mouse! Fuck! What is... What, there's an arrow pointing down there for some reason. I don't... I don't know why. Also, you can, like, hold the button instead of... Okay. Um... Is there other buttons I'm missing? There's only three on a Genesis, right? What do I do with you? Is that what I was supposed to have done with that? Oh, I can go down. Uh, or six, right, right, if you have the weird controller. Scorpion! Mystery man. Stick. Some games needed the six. Like fighting games, probably, would be my guess. I definitely don't have six. I only got four on my controller, so. Oh, shit, yeah, dude, give me the gun. Huh? Exit? I assure you there is not an exit there, but sure? Did I just lose my gun? Oh no, you can swap between them. Okay, cool. Hell yeah, dude. Why do you- why would you need the gun, though, if you could- Whoa! That certainly wasn't fair. 
<laughs> oh, is he gonna get up like a little, like a little skelly bone, dry bones thing? Oh God, this game is fully out to get you. Which I never understood games that are designed that way, because, like, you know it's not for a fucking arcade, right? Like... <laughs> oh, fuck off! Oh my god, and leaps of faith. Yeah, it's, it's just... What if I shoot the skeleton? <laughs> That's cool. That makes this better. This, this game asks the daring question of what if uh, Castlevania had a gun? And I, I appreciate it for that. Oh, yeah, dude, give me a bigger gun. Why do the bullets bounce? <laughs> it sucks. <laughs> well, at least I get to start over here with the gun, though. That's cool. Of course, you got me. All right. <laughs> Ow. Oh, you do lose the other gun, though. Um. Why is that there? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, no, it's a boss. <laughs> we didn't even get to see the boss. <laughs> All right, that game sucked really bad. <laughs> Not in like a crazy way or anything. It was just poorly made. Like that, that's an interesting one. That was yeah. I'm used to I'm used to a bad game feeling worse than that. So yeah. Anyway, I think that's all of the Genesis ones that I had that were like horror related that I could find uh, outside of like. Well, I guess we could try it. I've never played it. We could play Altered Beast. No, I've I've played it. I don't know why I said that. It's just, there's not much to it. It's just Altered Beast. Rise from your grave. I do, I do like that. This barely feels like I'm playing it. I gotta say, this, this barely feels like I'm in control of anything that's happening. Alright, okay, alright. Well, Jesus Christ. This, this game is also worse than I remember. <laughs> Spike McFang on SNES. I have not played that. Get kicked. What happened to him? Kick him in the fucking shin. Come here. Don't fucking punch me. Ow. Ow. Okay. Whoa. What? Power up. Hell yeah, dude. Oh my god, stop! Ah, god, dude! Okay, I'm done, I'm done. I hate it. I don't like Altered Beast. <laughs> I've never heard of Spike McFang. I don't think I have that one. I do have some other SNES ones. I guess I can show y'all. Kind of what I'm looking at here. Uh, we got, you know, some stuff. Here it is. There's things. Cool, right? Oh my god. <laughs> uh, so for SNES, uh, we've got like Alien 3, Alien vs. Predator. I forgot that even existed. That game rules, I think. It sounds like it rules anyway. Uh, I have Clock Tower, which is like definitely more of an involved one. Uh, Demon's Crest rules. Now I'm just looking at games and thinking about ones I've played before. That's not really the point of what we're doing today. Mary Shelley's Frankenstein. We got Madden 98. We could play that. That'd be fun. That's scary, right? What the hell is Nosferatu? That doesn't seem real. Also, that fully just looks like Dracula again. You've, you've done it wrong. That's just Dracula again. Uh, I kind of want to go back, though. Is there one on NES? I feel like there should be one on NES that we could play today. Let's try Friday the 13th. It was recently Friday the 13th. That works. That makes sense, right? Is the game not going to start? Start game. 
Is it broken? Hold on. What the fuck? Hold up, hold up, hold up. This does not seem to want to launch for some reason. Hmm. Interesting. Why? Uh. Try again. Play. <laughs> nope. Did I break it? Did I break my emulator? I may, I may have broken my emulator. <laughs> what about this one? No? What about this one? <laughs> this one works. <laughs> I did break it. This is not a, this isn't, <laughs> this is not a horror one. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> um, why won't this one work? What's different about this one and this one? Hold on. Okay. I gotta see what's linked to what. Yeah, that's just there. And it's like, fine. What's wrong with this one? <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> why? <laughs> Why is it not right? Um. Oh, I think I might know. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me fix this. Let me cook. I can fix this. I guess you can you can look at my big face while I fix this, I guess. I don't fucking know. Uh, <laughs> let's see. I think I know what I'm doing wrong. Let me fucking cook bro all right yeah it just has to be the thing okay 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 where is it <laughs> i gotta find the file <laughs> this is a very professional stream i need you to guys to, to understand that can i just like delete that in here yeah cool and then does this work now yep there we go i fixed it i'm a genius uh, this is, uh, the, this is the little kid Splatterhouse one, the little chibi Splatterhouse one. Uh, I'm really interested to see how this plays and how this works. It looks super fucking adorable. Oh! Rise from your grave. You're trying to figure out how Launchbox syncs with RetroArch? RetroArch? Um... I don't, I don't remember. <laughs> I'm not gonna be any help there because I, I had to look up everything every step of the way. Uh, the plus side, everything that you need to learn can probably be found on like their. This will be your grave. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is adorable. I love this. This is so fucking cute. Yes, dude, get the get the fuck out of here. Fuck off. Bye. <laughs> Yo. I even like how like cutesy and spooky the fucking music is. Oh, I got candy. Ow. Nope, 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 nope. Just keep going. Bah. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no! It moves a little fast, this game, this game moves really quickly. <laughs> Super fucking cute though, why did I hit continue? I'm on level one. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Okay, I'm, I'm looking to see if there's any like secret tech that I need to be aware of. Oh. Candy. Yeah, the candy heals you, I assume. Oh, oh, ap, ap. Ap, ap, ap. I'm so fucked. Oh god, oh god. I need candy. I need candy stat. Please have candy, yes. Haha, <laughs> cool. <laughs> this is adorable! Wow, why is he giving me the middle finger? Fuck you, man! Oh my god. Is this Thriller? <laughs> what, the, what am I supposed to do? 
supposed to do? I can't get up there. Can I just leave? Or just gotta watch this whole performance? <laughs> oh, fuck. I didn't know you were gonna throw shit at me. There's like a little bit of a momentum thing going on in this game that I haven't quite gotten the hang of. Like, you don't just stop whenever you hit the- whenever you stop moving. You kinda gotta give it a sec. Am I- am I doing this? Ah, shit! Okay. <laughs> I think we've seen enough. Very fucking cute, and I'm also glad I figured out how to fix my fucking emulator thing. <laughs> sometimes- sometimes it can be weird and silly. Fucking cute, though. I- I love that. Uh, that- that- uh, turns out I'm a huge fan of the Splatterhouse series, no matter how adorable it is. Uh, downloading the Poke Park ROM now. What's the terms of possession? Uh, I don't know. As loose as you want it to be, I guess. Um, I have no idea. <laughs> I know I need to get in here and delete some other shit real quick before we try and play the next game. because And that game reminded me of the next one we're playing, because the, the, I'm pretty sure fucking... Monster Party also has a very similar little thing uh, where you have to watch one of the guys dance. So we're going to play that next. Hell yeah, dude. You owned it when you were a kid. I guess that counts. I don't know. Uh, dude, this game's pretty notorious, I, I gotta say. I think, a, I think a lot of people have seen this one. Mark was walking home from a ball game. He looked up and saw a bright star. While he stared at it, the star got bigger and bigger. You think it's a no one gives a fuck kind of moment? Probably. That describes my whole channel. <laughs> the beauty of the star made his eyes moist. <laughs> so he didn't notice that the star fell and landed right in front of him. It wasn't a star, but a monster. Mark quickly asked, Who are you? I'm Bert. What's up? I'm looking for help. Evil monsters are out of control. <laughs> you see this game? I didn't, did I show it to you? I don't think I showed it to you. Uh, it is already notorious online, like on YouTube and stuff like that. So if you, if you watch some YouTubers, they've probably talked about it. Uh, even monsters are out of control in my world. Come and help me. I'm afraid to fight the evil monsters. <laughs> Don't worry. With your weapon, you'll be able to destroy them easily. I'm one of the three YouTubers you watch. Yeah, no, I, I haven't played this one before. Uh, this, this will be my first time actually playing it. I think, like, Game Grumps played this at one point. I think, uh, some other big ones. I don't know. This isn't a weapon. It's a bat. Bat. Batter. Anything is okay. Anyhow, let's go. Bert grabbed Mark's hand and flew away. <laughs> oh, good. I'm glad they're getting to know each other. Mark, my planet is dangerous. So we must act together. How? Like this. <laughs> then they fused together. <laughs> Fuck. One does roguelikes, one does Nintendo things, and I do occasionally make videos. Correct. <laughs> you just straight up kidnap the kid. They're fusing together, alright? This is Nintendo, though. This is how Mark's adventure began. By fusing with a mo fucking... Bird monster. Cool. <laughs> Just fucking... Hmm. My planet needs help. You have a stick. Let's fuse. Alright, round one start. Hell yeah. Oh, God. Alright, come here. What? You're not even a monster. You're just like a guy. You're just a guy. Legs. Hell yeah. Can I hit him? Ooh. Yeah, break those kneecaps, dude. Oh. Oh. God, okay, this game controls very sluggish. <laughs> uh, but it's fine. 
I like the explosions. Whoa! <laughs> Go in the mouth? Yeah, yeah. Hello, baby. Okay. <laughs> Get fucked. Okay, I don't think I'm in range. Hard to, there we go. There we go. I took a pill and now I'm, now I'm Birdman. Here we go. Oh my god. Yeah, baby! Question mark. We're about to run out of bird power. That's okay. Fucking deposit those into the anal, anal cavity of the fucking legs here. There we go. Alright. <laughs> hit, hit, hit him in the kneecap. There we go. This gives you reskinned old Mario vibes? Does it now? I don't see Mario in this at all. I just see. I just see Mark and Bird, dude. Oh, dude, you can just farm infinite bird power from that? In here. Empty. Damn. Okay. So the moral of the story is sometimes doors are empty, I guess. There's not always things to do. There's not always a pitcher plant to, to kill. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I'm dead. Are you? I don't think you're dead. Uh, I guess you are. I guess he's dead. <laughs> oh! Is that a jump scare? Whoa, everything is infinitely more fucked up now. Oh. Ah! <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, don't send me fucking links in my chat. What are you talking about? What is this? Looks like a reskinned GBA Mario. Well, aren't the GBA Marios just ports of the original ones? Yeah, like that's just a that's just a port of Mario too. I think. Yeah, that's Mario too. <laughs> it kind of it kind of has that vibe, I guess. Nobody can see what I'm looking at. Now you can. <laughs> this, this is just Mario too. See Mario too. All right, back to the thing. Back to Monster Party. All right, we can't we can't be fucking around. We're we're playing Monster Party. <laughs> still don't see it. I don't. Yeah, no. I still really. I still don't really see it. No. In here? Please don't pick on me. I wasn't planning on it. Fuck. Oh my god. Ow. I'm dying so hot. I'm gonna. Fuck. Stop it. God. It's harder than it looks, muffin. <laughs> Game rules. Ah, fuck. Okay, I should be using save states if I want to get any kind of progress here, shouldn't I? Because I feel like I don't have anything now, huh? At least this game has good music. Yeah, Mario has terrible music. Hello, baby! Oh my god. Should I be hitting him or the balls? Balls. Balls. Hit the balls. It's hard to di You can't direct them, though, is the problem. Ow. Okay, the real answer is don't fucking get into a fight without bird power. That's the real fucking answer. Jesus Christ. He gave me a tummy ache and I died. Alright. <laughs> that... That one's interesting. I enjoyed that, at least to some degree. I, I would need, like, some save states and shit to actually beat it. But I kind of liked that, because that had a lot of interesting stuff going on. Um, I don't fucking know what to do now. I'm running out of games. I mean, I'm not. There's still a billion games, but I'm, like, running out of patience for them. <laughs> I feel like... Let's do this one. Fester's Quest. Ooh, I do have Fester's Quest. Is that... Is that a horror game? Does that count? Ooh, hold on. Hold on, this one's spooky, dude. 
This one's scary. Um, <laughs> he does look like that, though. Elm Street. What the fuck do you mean, four player? What? This is NES. NES doesn't have four slots. One player. Also, multiplayer is weird. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. <laughs> not expecting to start my Nightmare on Elm Street game by punching a snake. It's published by LJN and has four player support. The four score. Oh, oh, I think I know what you're talking about. It's like a multi-tap kind of thing. You plug it into the thing and it gives you four ports. That's weird. Don't be sad, Muffin. Why are you sad? And also, why are you tagging me? I'm already here. I'm, I'm gonna read your chat. <laughs> Don't worry. Retro Arch doesn't support Wii. I don't think it does, no. It's not retro enough. Uh, but there's Dolphin. And you can still run Dolphin through Launchbox, so. Oh, I'm dead. Bye. I'm a different guy now. Do I go in the houses? Can't. Can I go in the houses? I don't think I can go in the houses. I'm just punching rats and bats and stuff. Why does every fucking horror game involve me punching rats and bats? Why does every fucking old school- Who are you? Hello? That's not Freddy. You're not Freddy. Oh god. Just stuck. There we go. Am I supposed to be- Oh, I probably am supposed to be going in here. What the fuck? The fucking music is a bop, though. Hell yeah, dude. What? Huh? What just happened? Okay. Oh no. I don't like that. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Whoa. I hate that little Freddy spider. Come here. I hate you. Can I not hurt you? Too many Freddy spiders. Oh, my God. There's too many of them. Come on. Fuck you. Fuck you. I got him. Okay. Ah. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, I thought you told me to stop talking, Muffin. You told me to stop taking drugs. Neither of which are things I can do, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm so bad at this. Oh, okay. <laughs> we'll have to wait for Kermit to go. <laughs> but, like... So there's, like, these Nightmare Freddy heads around here, right? And then there's just a fucking sheet ghost. <laughs> And you punch the sheet goes to live. Oh, that's amazing, dude. Oh, my score goes up when I punch a Freddy. Come here. Let me get my score up. High score time, baby. Let's go. If you die in the if you die in the dream, you die for real, though, right? Where where am I supposed to find coffee? You told me I need to find coffee and shit to stay awake, but I don't. Okay, I, I keep dying. Continue, I guess. How many of those do I have? Got him. Um, there's a down arrow here, and I don't know how to use it. Tangy Bob, you seem like the expert on this game. How do I do this? What do I do? How do I... How do I do this? I don't know. <laughs> kind of sucks that RetroArch doesn't come with games. I mean, you gotta find them. Freddy's coming! TM. Whoa, 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 hey! What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell is going on? Fucking stop it. Oh, did he get himself? I think he got himself with his claws. That's funny. Freddy's always been such a bumbling fucking... Alright, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh. Oh, 
yeah. Am I supposed to be able to kill Freddy? Is that the goal? I punched the hell out of him. I've done more than fucking anybody in the actual movie series has been able to do. I wish you could just punch the hell out of Freddy. Get out of here. Where are you going? <laughs> Come back here. Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Makes sense. It's Nightmare on Elm Street. Correct. This is Nightmare on Elm Street, the video game. They should make another one of these that's just like this, because this is awesome. <laughs> just with better graphics. Just this exact game, but with different graphics. Not even better, just different. Like, I want to see what's in the game designers' heads when they made these little Freddy spiders. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do, dude. Like, they had to have been picturing something a little weirder than this, right? And the and these. <laughs> Those are so funny to me. I don't know what I'm doing! Okay, I, I don't go there, clearly. I, I don't live here. Oh my god, dude, I keep dying. Bye. I'm leaving. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Shit! Give me a chance, game. Fuck. <laughs> jump. Actually jump this time. Just leave it, because I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to be doing here. I don't know what the goal of this game is, period. I guess to kill Freddy, but I... Oh, I can't leave here either, huh? Well, what do I do? You don't get life zero. I mean, that was... I had to continue, is the thing. Fuck. Okay. Sure, man. I guess I fell in the pit. <laughs> the game's just lying to me now, gaslighting me. Hmm... <sighs> I don't understand what the fuck I'm supposed to do here. I have two buttons and I've pushed them both multiple times. N we're not celebrating. <laughs> I like the aggressive branding on the fucking heads up display too. Like that's fun. I like that it doesn't like you couldn't have just made like a dynamic HUD that tells you uh, if you're like up to four players or we're not or whatever. It's just. <laughs> All of it simultaneously at all times. It all exists. And it's also aggressively branded. <laughs> this super feels like where I'm supposed to be going. Because there's like a big arrow here, but I do not know what I'm doing. Okay. It says press up? I've tried that. I've pushed all the buttons. Okay. I mean, the game itself here says press down. You can't tell me that doesn't say press down. <laughs> so hold it. I'm holding it. I'm hitting other buttons. Freddy's coming. <laughs> I don't know why he's here, but that's fine. Bye. I mean, I was fucking tankish hits. Like, I don't care. I'm a fucking... I'm the hero, dude. I'll fucking survive. He can't kill me. Freddy can't do shit. And his ugly-ass fucking fedora. And he got me. But I'm back. And I'm ready for more. <laughs> this is definitely one of those games that feels like you can just throw yourself at forever and, until it happens. Okay, I'm done with that. <laughs> Uh, let's see. You said Fester's, or Tanky Pop said Fester's Quest. We can do Fester's Quest. I have that somewhere. Fester's Quest. There we go. It's horror themed. It's spooky. It's got Fester in it. Jesus Christ. Let's start. Oh, hell yeah, dude. We got boogers. 
<laughs> we got a booger blaster. What? Huh? Oh, it still hurt me. Oh. You beat this game for the first time in like 2003? Oh. This is definitely a game where you need the fucking turbo button on the controller, don't, isn't it? Oh my god. I don't know shit about this game. I feel like Angry Video Game Nerd probably covered it at some point. Because he covers all these kind of shitty games that suck ass, right? You are born in 2003. Jesus Christ. You are a baby child. Whoa, what the hell is this? This seems bad. <laughs> this is bad. This fucking toenail launcher sucks. Ugh. You were beating games in the 80s? <laughs> that makes you feel... Okay. I, uh... I don't think I beat a video game until I was, like, 20. Like, as much as I played them and as much as they were part of my life as a kid, like, I never... I don't know, that, I, I never beat them. I think I've talked about this that before on, like, the, the channel multiple times. Where I, like, have this problem where I don't really beat video games. Unless I'm streaming them or something. Like, I play them until I'm done playing them. Or until I buy a new one. Because <laughs> I'm just always chasing that fucking... I'm always chasing that serotonin, you know? Fuck. Jesus Christ, dude. This absolutely needs a fucking... Ah, oh, no, dude. I got frogged. That's it? That's the end? That's this, That's game over? You get one life? Oh my god. The closest you've ever gotten was 97.1% on Star Wars The Complete Saga. Wait, no, this is different. This is new. Um, I don't even know if I ever beat, like, the Lego Star Wars games when I was a kid. You always start back there when you continue, but I have the toenail gun. It's just me or do you prefer the toenail blaster to the fucking goober launcher? Toenail blaster sucks, dude. Is there a different gun? Because this one really sucks. It's bad. And also, I'm getting so much money, I don't know what to do with money. Does money even factor into this game? Who knows? Oh my god. This is... This is a game that has, like... And we've talked about, like, conveyance in video games a little bit, right? Where, like, a game uses itself and its engine to teach you how the game works. This game does not do that. This is one of those games where you need the manual to know what the fuck is happening. Or to just play it a lot. And that's my least favorite type of thing. Just because I don't... I don't understand what's happening. I, I'm collecting light bulbs. And keys? I'm sure they do something. <laughs> I'm sure... I'm sure they do something. Brand blue guns till you get the max gun, then power through. What the hell is that? Light bulbs are used in sewers to see? I died before I even saw any of that. Hold on, we're getting some hot dogs. Hold the fuck on. Hold on, dude, it's hot dog time. Boom, hot dogs. I like that a lot of this looks like it was stolen straight from Zelda. Hot dogs. Give me hot dogs! What the fuck?! You advertise hot dogs to me and you don't let me have one?! Are you fucking kidding me?! Um, oh. Okay. Fester's the one who has electricity in him. He's- he's one of the goobers. You have to use inventory- Oh, I have inventory! Whip? I have gun three. Or money at the hot dog stand. Okay, so you can buy hot dog. That's good to know. Uh, what? Huh? Oh god, ma mouse, mouse rats. Oh my god. <laughs> Why are you an expert in this game? I, I don't know, but I'm glad you're here, and I'm glad you know. Can't imagine how he gets in the pool. Dude, you're so right. Uncle Fester is the guy of all time, for sure. There's another key. More money. 
I guess I go by hot dog now. <laughs> hot dog? Yeah, hot dog. Or HDT dog, or whatever the fuck that says. That doesn't really say hot dog. Oh my god, dude, and your bees are immortal! Immortal bees! Fuck, dude, your bees gonna kill me! I'm slow. Um, money. Did I do it? Uh -huh. I'm buying hot dogs. I don't need vice grips? I don't have any. Is that why I'm slow? Oh my god. This is abysmal. I don't know how I'm supposed to get vice grips. And I do not want to play this game like this. The real question is, Tangy Pop, why the fuck are you an expert at this game? <laughs> Muffin, I think you're right. I think I did just spend $35 on hot dogs. <laughs> Get them from one of the houses. Oh, well, this frog's dead. Ooh, gun. Alright, well. I guess we'll... Oh, here we go. We can do this. Boom. Oh, whoop. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, I'm on an emulator, baby. You can speed that shit up. <laughs> It's cheating, I know, but it's fine, because it's Fester's Quest and no one cares. <laughs> you just gotta make sure you don't, uh, <laughs> you don't overdo it, because you don't want to die. I like the overscan that you can very clearly see in this game, too. Oh, 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 frog. Oh my god, dude. No! 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 Get off me, you fuck! Alright, we... I'm done. Ah, <laughs> uh, what a weird fucking... What a weird thing. What a weird state the world is in with these games, man. Like... Like I said, so many of them are just stuck in that, like... Uh... The, the idea of, like... Uh... <laughs> A horror game is a game that is inspired by Halloween decorations, basically, was like the whole thing. And I guess I get it, because with a lot of limited, a lot of limitations like that at the time, it's much, much harder to try and like scare somebody. But I think we've seen in modern times, people limit themselves in these ways uh, and still deliver something scary. Like Faith comes to mind. Like that has Atari graphics. Granted, I think it does more than an Atari could actually do. Uh, but I think you could have done something like it on, like, the NES or something, you know? So, very interesting, though. And obviously capitalism, uh, <laughs> capitalism does, does change a lot of things, because you do want to make sure people want to buy the game, and I think there was definitely a difference in horror culture at the time, where people didn't want to buy a thing that would intentionally scare them in a lot of ways, which is why you end up with, like, a lot of slasher movies and shit. So, anyway... Uh, really interesting stuff. I had a lot of fun with a lot of these today. Like, I, I genuinely do think, uh, I'm gonna go back and play some more Splatterhouse 3. Maybe some more Splatterhouse 2. Maybe I will make a little video about the, the game design of those games. Uh, cause those are cool. And I need to find a way to get a hold of Splatterhouse 1. I think it's just an arcade cabinet. I guess I can look that up. I don't think it got a real home release, unless it was on something weird. Uh, yeah, okay, that's what it is. It was, it was, an, yeah, Turbo Graphics, exactly. It was also on the Turbo Graphics 16, which I don't, I don't have a, uh, an emulator for. I don't have an actual Turbo Graphics, and I don't have any games for the Turbo Graphics. So that would be, that would definitely be much shakier for me to play. But I mean, it's all abandonware at this point, man. Who gives a fuck? TG16 is dope. You should send me a list of some good Turbo Graphics 16 games. Uh, and I should find out how to get a TurboGrafx-16 emulator because uh, that seems really, really cool. And it, it's it's what it would be one of those like uh, one of those like blind blind spots for me, right? Because like I never grew up with one, so I want to play some TurboGrafx-16 stuff. I want to play some like Atari Jaguar stuff. Uh, I want to get a hold of a CDI emulator at some point and play some of that weird shit. Like, there's tons of stuff. Uh, do I like shmups? I 
do sort of um because that's like 80 percent of the turbo graphic 16 that probably explains why uh my one of my best friends he fucking loves the turbo graphic 16 and it's probably because that he he's a huge shmup fan uh or at least he was he maybe he's done some other shit now but like uh yeah he and he got to work on like some of the bigger one of the companies that makes some big shmups over in japan still so yeah uh i should i should check that out and duplicate that <laughs> you tried to run poke park in 8k Ooh, fun uh i mean yeah we i mean i i really enjoy this is just now an ad for launchbox like i think i think this service is really cool because it does let you have a lot of freedom and a lot of stuff the like overlay that you guys are seeing in the uh here where i have like the my branding behind it and everything uh that's something you can do in retroarch and you know launchbox and stuff like that and you can run things with with it they'll have their own bevel sometimes if you let the game if you let it download its own thing uh or you can just have it run on its own thing anyway i don't really know what the fuck i'm talking about here i just spent a lot of time fucking with this today so i know that like uh there's a lot of interesting features hidden in launchbox that uh, I think could use some light shined upon them because it's really interesting. Uh, that being said, I think Splatterhouse 3 moves up to one of my favorite Genesis games of all time. Uh, that game, that's it's fucking awesome. I love that. I need to play. I still need to, I need to play the uh, PS3 360 Splatterhouse on stream at some point. I have it on PS3 uh, and because that game is also really fun. And not a lot of people have seen it or played it, I think. So that could be cool. Uh, but yeah, today was today was cool. Today was a success, I think. Uh, and I think with that, we are going to go ahead and call it a stream so that I can go ahead and get some dinner in me and whatever. I'm really hungry, actually. Now that, I, now that I've said that, I'm really I'm really feeling it. Uh, you like the random retro streams? I do too. I call them dumpster dives just because I'm a possum and I like to dig through the garbage. But I like that there, there's a lot of really cool stuff in the retro stuff. Uh, and I know that I'm not going to always get a chance to like do a full playthrough of a game. You know, like I don't think I'm ever going to do a full playthrough stream of Splatterhouse 3. But I like that I get to showcase it to you guys and play it for a little bit just for my own enjoyment. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, plus, I have, like I said, I have a, I have a shit ton of retro games. I want to do more PS2 streams. Uh, I'm really, really thinking of doing. Um, this is just a fully aside. Most people have left at this point because I'm. I've already sounded like I'm ending the stream. Uh, <laughs> this is just just for me. Uh, I'm. I'm really considering doing like a football game stream at some point. Uh, and I think if I do that, I'm probably gonna do ESPN NFL 2K5. Uh, just because I think that one's really, really fun. And I want to play a football game. And it's probably just going to happen because I keep... That's all I'm doing with my free time anymore is playing football. Maximum football is coming out soon. So they say. Uh, they they said 2023 and then I haven't heard anything since. I'm really interested in maximum football. There's also that weird blitz one you found. Was that the... Uh, the new one, right? The maximum card football or some shit? I forget what it was called. Uh... Yeah, I'm actually really interested in that one. It is forty dollars though, which is I think a bit steep, uh, but it does look really fun. So maybe maybe I'll do that one though. Maybe I'll just fucking do Madden. Maybe I'll just bite the bullet and play Madden on stream at some point. <laughs> oh, the Tecmo Bowl one, yeah, Retro or Legend Bowl or Retro Bowl or something. One of them's a phone game. I think Retro Bowl is the phone game. Saxophone. Hey, well, <laughs> welcome to the stream, Hell's Falls. Thanks for joining us. We are ending soon, however. Uh, I don't know. I'm not going to play any saxophone right now, but I missed your comment. Uh, did I? Oh, no, I was going to get back to it. Uh, I beat Among the Sleep for you. I did. I play. I played all the way through Among the Sleep for you. It was like a two hour game, though. So that was perfect for my stream. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, but yeah, Hell's Falls, we are we are ending stream. So we are uh, just kind of winding down, chatting for a sec. Uh, talking about future content, which we are going to be streaming tomorrow, I believe. I'll let it, I'll let y'all know if I don't, but I should. Uh, regular time, 4.30 p.m. Mountain Standard Time, Mountain Daylight Time, whatever it is right now. Uh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, we'll be live tomorrow, probably with some more Resident Evil, but we could change. I could change my mind. I don't fucking know. We'll do something. Uh, but anyway, this outro has gone on very long and been long winded. But I super appreciate you guys hanging out with me today. Uh, this is 
Uh, we stream Tuesday, Wednesday. I assume that's Thursday. 6.30 to 8.30 EST. Is that what it is in Eastern? Interesting. Uh, yeah, usually it's Tuesday through Friday. Usually we do... That, that's the goal. <laughs> Things have been a little chaotic lately just because I, uh... I'm, like, working on moving and stuff, and I'm canceling and shuffling streams around, but I added Friday. I've been doing Fridays. Like, like a normal week for... A normal <laughs> week of streams for me is Tuesday through Friday. Uh, but I do cancel fairly often. <laughs> uh, there's, always, there's always also the VOD channel if you want to watch more of me. Uh, not live. And then I have my main YouTube channel as well if you're interested. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to get the hell out of here. I did Community Fridays. I did. I did for a while there. Uh, sh shout out to Possum. Yeah, dude. Shout out to me, bro. <laughs> uh, we're so close to being caught up on VODs. I mean, we basically are caught up on VODs. Like, I don't have yesterday's up. <laughs> and I don't have today's right now. Valheim server win. Yeah, we've been talking about that forever, haven't we, Tangy Pop? <laughs> Uh, you guys just throwing it in my face that I haven't done any community games in a while. <laughs> uh, just downloaded Valheim. I don't. I don't think I even own Valheim yet. I still don't have that game. So, <laughs> it's, it's cost money probably. So I don't have it. <laughs> uh, I should do Valheim servers next. Yeah, that settles it. Uh, I should do some community games at some point soon, but it's hard whenever, like, I don't even know if I'm going to stream, let alone try and schedule with other people. So, yeah. Anyway. Oh, it's on Game Pass? Ooh, okay. I didn't know that. Maybe. Maybe then. I probably do have it then, because I got Game Pass, so. I haven't played anything on Game I've thought about getting rid of my Game Pass for a while, too. That's a whole other subject, but uh, I haven't been using it. <laughs> I thought about playing Liza P on stream too, and that's on Game Pass. Anyway, this, I don't know what the fuck's happening. I almost did my little outro and said goodbye and everything. We're just chatting still. Uh, I gotta go though. I love you guys. We can talk more tomorrow. Okay, bye.